tomorrow night may not just be another Friday night under the lights, but they'll be putting it all out on the line because for these three boys, it's not about what they're playing for. It's about who they're playing for. Hayden Athey is wearing pink for his mom. I never thought that she was going to die. She lost the battle to lung cancer in February. Now that she's gone, it's just giving me more meaning. Like I want her to look down on me and say, I'm proud of you. Last season was the last time she ever saw her son play. Every game, every single game, she was always over there cheering for me, screaming her head off. Everybody could hear her. That was always very special. And now a special day to remember those who have been affected by cancer. St. Teresa's Real Men Wear Pink football game. This is a game I probably always played my hardest because my mom fought so hard to get through her situation. Chris Isom wears pink for his mom who beat breast cancer. Yeah. Colton Kramer wears pink for his aunt who also beat breast cancer. And his dad who died from cancer his first day of high school. I miss him a lot. The three boys have used football to get them through the hard times. It just frees your mind and what you're thinking about is like the next down, you know, who you're going to block, who you're going to tackle, that kind of stuff. So it really does help. It's an unbreakable brotherhood. Much needed when families have been broken by a disease. Whenever I do get in the game, you'll definitely see me going 110 percent. It's a game against cancer that the players will fight to win for loved ones. Oh! Tomorrow night, teammates will also be remembering and playing for Adam Carter. He was a former St. Teresa football player. He would have been a sophomore this year, but died of cancer a couple of years ago. I'm Elise Meneker for WAND News.